good morning I am in the garden these are my containers that I normally use to grow my tomatoes my eggplants and uh, my cucumbers today I'm planting my tomato plants if you remember I had them in containers um, that I repurposed uh, just to give them a little room to grow. Let's see if I can find the other one. And now it's time to get them in their containers so they can produce some fruit. Now I'm adding to my container, it's called a Oya. This will hold water. You bury it right alongside the roots of your plants. So even if you weren't able to get outside to uh, water your plants, then the oil will hold the water and it releases it as the soil uh, or the roots of the plants dry out. So I'm going to, I've already placed my tomato plant in the ground. I've broken off a, or snapped off a few of the leaves at the bottom and buried them and angled it so it will grow up. As you can see, I have stakes here and they're covered so they won't do any damage, a plastic covering, so it shouldn't do any damage to the plant as it produces fruit. So I'm just going to bury my oil, lid comes off, and you add your water, cover it up, and it will release the water as the plant needs it. I have a potting mixture here, and I've added some worm castings to it as well. You don't need to get the, oops, here we go. Don't need to get, okay, it's gonna stand up. Don't need to get the soil inside the oil, but you do want to bury it as much as you can. So that's what I'm doing. This is my mortgage lifter, and the other oil I have is early girl tomatoes. So we're potting up the tomato plants today, and hopefully soon we will bear some fruit. And that's how I do my containers of tomatoes, cucumbers, and eggplants. On the other side, I have my collards growing, squash, and later this summer, I will do a bed of pumpkins. All right, I hope you're having a wonderful day. The angle is a little off, but it's hard to film and have you both hands in the dirt at the same time. If you like my videos, please like, share, and subscribe. Happy gardening.